Okay, it's time for our commodity segment and Manisha Gupta is joining in for exactly that. Today, she is focusing on coffee. What is happening? This is this is a market we're really interested in, Manisha. So tell us more. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for that, Zibri. Well, I'm looking at the price. It's surging higher and we are trading at a multi-month highs right now. And that is on the back of shrinking global inventories and supplies. So when you look at the ICE Robusta inventories, they have declined to a record low of around 3,600 lots. And the ICE Arabica inventories also have declined to an eight-month lows of 513 thousand contracts there so the markets also are looking at lower production and export numbers and that is bothering as per the international coffee organization the october to june global coffee exports have declined by 6.2 percent there is lower production as well and that is what brings us to the next point which is deficits that you're looking at rabobank for one says that 2022-23 has seen coffee deficit estimated at 6.4 million bags other major coffee trader which is wall cafe says that 2023-24 also could be looking at a deficit of 5.6 million bags international coffee organization says that this year they're looking at 7.3 million bags of deficit last year was 7.1 million bags so we are carrying forward deficits and the next year could be of a deficit as well and that is going to keep the coffee prices on the higher side Take a look at what the U.S. Department of Agriculture says. They say that 2023-24, while the Arabica production could increase by 6.9%, but Robusta will see a decline by 2.4%. For the Indian markets as well, the unseasonal rains and deficient rains, especially in the coffee-growing regions of Karnataka, Kerala, Tamil Nadu, could be impacting the crop. And we have seen coffee prices gain up and also seem in true to the retail pricing as well, which has seen an year-on-year -year percentage gain of nearly 15%. All right, Manisha, thanks a lot for getting us all of the details on how coffee prices are really moving. But with that, we are going to get into a 